What's up guys, this is Jake from Luminary TV, bringing you another first impressions gameplay of Stardew Valley. Now if you don't know what Stardew Valley is, it is a Harvest Moon-esque type game, RPG elements, uh, beautiful art design. We're just going to get right into it and check it out. Alright guys, this is Jake, and this is my farm name is Luminary TV, I like dogs. And uh, my animal preferred pre preference is dogs, also. So let's get right into it. Already, already can say art design. I'm loving it. And for my very special grandson, I want you to have this sealed envelope. Envelope of approval. Now listen close. There will come a time. I'm adding time. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life and your bl bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness when that happens my boy you'll be ready for this gift now let grandpa rest really sad really sad I work at Joja join us thrive work Everybody works at Joja. Just terminated. That guy has a that guy has a a cowboy hat. He looks like the Twinkie. And I'm over here. Look, I look like an old man with my beard and everything. And that that person is dead. That person has died. Is that how is that how working is? That person will die. Let's open it up. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Luminary TV Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Thanks, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for, for me, will you? Well, I guess that doesn't sound so bad after all. Beautiful green, uh, this reminds me of the Windows screen, Sp splash screen. Put a picture up, let me see. Anyway, Stardew Valley, 0.5 miles away. Come along to the journey. Robin, you must be Jake. I'm Robin. I'm Robin! That's one of those. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Uh, Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you follow me. Love 8-bit styles. I love, 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 love 8-bit style. Ah, oh, it's so colorful. This is Luminary Farm, obviously, and it's dirty. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's a good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. And here we are, your new home. That's a nice cabin home. Hey, Lewis! Ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. Pelican? Where's that catch him? What'd you do with him? Oh, and I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in the box here and I'll come during the night to collect it. He just comes during the night and steals all your shit. Lewis. Crazy old fuck. Alright, let's see. Oh, wow, we can move things around like that? Can I, like, interact with it? Oh, weather report. Welcome to KLZU5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Alright, well, that's good. Journal, getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe. Damn right, use that hoe. 
uh, to, t uh, the, till the soil, uh, to till the soil, and then use this pocket seed on the soil to crop cultivate. Uh, it would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet new farmer. Nice. Hoen. Um, Hoen. I feel overexerted. Where does it show me that? Oh, my energy's right here. Is there anything to eat? Okay, so I can't just, um... I'll go to sleep, then. It's 11 a.m. What am I doing? Alright, I'll sleep. I got something in the mail. Just got back from fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for ya. Oh, that was terrible. Is there any dirt anywhere? I don't know what that. Those are seeds. Damn it. Looks like a middle finger. Okay, not aesthetically appealing, but we're just gonna make that work. Everything's watered. Everything is awesome. Now I'm gonna go back to this town. I don't know how to get over there. Alright, how how do I get out of here? I, I guess I have to take my way out. Linus. A stranger, hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. Alright. Yeah. Wild horse horse a dish. Hor horse a dish. Hor hor or a horse radish. Horse a dish. What am I saying? Hello, sir. Greetings. Demetrius. I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Pelican Town. This looks shabby as fuck. Haley. Nice. Haley looks good. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Oh, I'm Haley. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. Oh, wow. What an asshole. Thanks. California seeds, potato seeds. Tulip jazz seeds take seven days to produce a blue puffball flower. Sugar. I should. I feel like I should stick with uh, barnip and bean. The cheap. I feel like the cheaper the better. Actually. Actually. I'll, oh my. Sam. Sam looks ex extravagant. His hair, at least. Oh, a stranger. My name is Vincent. It's nice to meet you, Vincent. I like your hair over Sam's hair, I'm not gonna lie. Mommy says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Yes. Bearded man. Uh, jacket. I look fine. Penny. Penny's my girl. <laughs> I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. I don't know what's down here. Oh, the beach. Oh, but you go inside there. Wow, and then she locks it. Wow. I'm just out here trying to talk to somebody. Oh, the fisherman. Ahoy there, it's nice to see you young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. It's about 8 o'clock at night. I gotta get home, get some sleep so I can start, start my next day. You know what time it is? It's time to get things done. And apparently, it's raining. So this is a perfect time to get things done, like cleaning up. Alright. I cleaned up the pathway. I feel like if they added, like... A little music like to set the tone especially on a rainy day like this would be fantastic all right south of town I, I, I was just there I just have to make sure to get there before five. Oh, nice Willie's right there I'm a scrub player old man ahoy there son heard there was a new comer in town good to finally meet you here I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that uh, that the art o art o fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Gotcha, Willie. Well, thank you. It's raining. It's the perfect time to uh, go fishing. There we go. And let's just hang out and try to fish. Welcome to Fishing Simulator 2016. Oh my god. Well, that sucked. Well, my, my old pappy used to tell me all the days that you go fishing. Fishing was a, a man's sport. Come on. Ooh. Oh, what the heck? 
Almost. Almost. There we go. A sardine. Sweet. What is this? Is this somebody's house? Hello, Grandma. Evelyn. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny. I'll call you Granny. George, hmm. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Hmm. Everybody has the same accent. That's just how it. That's how they're just gonna be. Well, wow, there's an arcade over here, too. Oh, wow, this is cool. Alright. This is like a. Wow. Let's at least get to 10. Oh, okay, I don't know where I was at. Like, it doesn't tell me. I'm just like, guessing where I'm at. One last try. You can't handle me. Oh, oh they can. Alright, let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. There we go. Fourth day of spring. Here we come. Or like rainy days, you get no no music. Like maybe you can put like a little like happy tune, but like like rain music. Fifth day of spring. I wonder how many days of spring we're going through. Let's try to find these last two people, and, and hopefully we can get on with the day. The people, but sewer people, teenage mutant ninja turtles, and it's locked. <sighs> they don't want me to hang. They don't want me to hang out with them. You look no cool. I've met you. Sam's trying to do a kickflip. Let me see. Pop shove it, but close enough. All right, sir. There you go. There's no sir here. Only Mountain Man. Uh, Mountain Man is a. Uh... Oh, nice. You can hear someone inside though. Is it locked? Do I jump up? What the hell? Jesus, why is this place so dirty? Is this my place? Good lord, is this my place? Good lord. Of course it's my place. <laughs> I want to sleep 6 o'clock, you know, normal day. Another 125 gold, let's go on with it. Fifth day of spring. Year one. Oh wow, no way. They finally came through. I've, I've come to the conclusion I will never find the last three people, ever. What about in here? K people? Holy crap. There is a person in here. Marlin. Thank god. Oh my, that's one. Hello, Marlin. I was just peeking down in the old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place, undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Hello, sir. Are you the blacksmith? Clint. Hi, I'm Clint. Oh, Clint, I meant you. Finally, one person. Can I end the night off well? Turn on my fire. Sit down. In a chair, I guess. Nope. Psych. And just lay in bed. <sighs> Alright, guys. Well, oh, my farming level went up. Nice. Alright, guys. That's a sixth day of spring in the year one. I'm actually going to end the video off right there. Sadly, I will not be able to find the last person. This is uh, my final thoughts on the game. I think the game is fantastic. It's a beautiful looking game. The art design is great. I love the 8-bit feel. It's really nailing that Harvest Moon feel. And especially, you know, with the township so, so involving. With so much there to do, questing. It's very interesting. I mean, meeting new people. Except for finding this one last person, and it doesn't really tell you who the, who that person is. You just kind of have to figure it out on your own. The map is a little confusing, but I guess with time, with more more time you play this game, you'll understand the map a lot better. I mean, they have cave systems, they have uh, mining carts. They, you know, you can go into the cave and fight things with a sword. The Adventurers Guild, I guess. There's a lot to do in this game. I can't wait to get back into this game, but for now, if you like Harvest Moon mixed in with a little bit of Zelda kind of adventuring questing with a great story so far, 
I mean, a very minimal story, just telling you to do things like farm. But if you like that easygoing farm life or want to experience the farm life for yourself, I highly suggest you pick up this game. Anyways, that's it for me. If you guys like this video, remember to leave a comment down below. Like, thumbs up, really helps us a lot. Yeah, if you want me to continue this gameplay, just uh, let me know. The more likes uh, this video has, I will consider coming back to this game and actually doing you know, a full let's play of it. Anyways, I hope to see you guys on the next video. I'm Jake from Luminary TV. See you guys.